Hello, people. This is Master Berkner, M07 Productions, and today. Do not click that link. Ouch! Oh God! <laughs> I saw my face, and it was scary. <laughs> yes, it. Ah! Ow! I fell. Okay, let me put my armor back. <laughs> I'm absolutely loving starting videos like that. That's just absolutely perfect. Ouch! Where did the anvil go? It probably broke. Oh, good point. That was a spawn one, right? No. Oh, well, shit. <laughs> there goes a bunch of iron. I was hoping we spawned it. Okay, um, so... Ouch! Oh, fuck! I'm getting huge chunks of lag still. You're just, you're just getting raped. Yeah, I'm actually running at only like 30 FPS, which is not normal for me. Mm. Uh, well, you know, molestation, that occurs. It does. Uh, hello, Mr. Zombie. Are, are you having a nice day? Both of those are off. Let's say. <laughs> turn off custom colors, turn off smooth biomes. Uh, I don't really know what natural textures are. A grid like pattern created by. Uh, Charlie? Yeah. A furious zombie. Oh well. Uh, and. Because you're having me use a damn mouse, it's not working. You don't have to use a mouse. Okay, so last time we left off of me growing seeds to make these things. I have since then got up a small ME system. And when I say small, I mean small. Remember when you're in these things, if you're hovering over the thing, you can't hit T for some reason. I don't know why. Yep. I really don't know why. So we've got a few terminals. So I guess I'm going to start off in here. This is the admin terminal. This is literally the only thing on this channel, and that's all it will be. This right here. That's all it is. This right here is for me. Here's our hard drives. I just filled it up completely. Don't um, worry, I'll be ruining his, his organization system in a matter of hours. I mean, that's the, this right here kind of fixes the organization system period, unless you just like fill up all the fucking hard drives. <coughs> Which then I'll be pissed. So here's Alex's, he liked green, so I made his green. If you don't know how to do this, um, it's very simple. If you use, you can use any of the cable getting up to here. Like, I'm using Ender IO conduits to transfer it all the way over here. Um, maybe you could see it. Yeah. And as you can see, we have dodo birds. Yeah, I'm using ME Ender IO conduit from there. And then the very last one it has to be actual applied energistics cable. So, well, they just connect, straight up connect. Well, if you color that cable, it changes the color of the terminal, which is really fucking cool. Yep, it is. So Now to show them what I got up to after we ended the, our last recording. Yep, uh, well, I, I want to show off the other two terminals. So he got green. And this one up here was really kind of just for Cassie, but overall, he's it's yellow. And then in here, simply because it's machines and shit, that fucking windmill. It's like magenta. All right, and I think that's all of it. All right, so what what we what'd you do again? This one. Did not do a infusion or two as well. I can't remember. Uh, possibly. Oh, and in case you haven't seen it on YouTube yet, which I, I don't think you have, um, these wonderful torches, they just, they just ruin these poor little bastards' day. Just look at them, Charlie. I, I think, them. I think this was, and think the torches were caught, because I remember seeing something about it when making the seeds. Holy shit, there's a lot of zombies here. I know, it's just a magical thing to watch, and they can't do anything. Just look at that dispenser zombie. There's shooting arrows and it's just going everywhere else. 
Too bad you can't collect blood from anywhere. Uh, well... I wonder uh, if this is why I'm lagging. I wonder if this right here is why I'm lagging. Uh, there's no telling. Let me just... I think the random mobs is what was doing. Holy shit, yes, that increased my FPS. What happened? I turned off random mobs. Because my computer has the power to do it. I just lose like 30 FPS when doing it. Know what we need now? An army what? of uh, an, an army of golems. Know what I mean? Nah, we just need a couple of dispensers. Nah, we need an army of golems. They're free to run. No, I mean literally. We could just stand right here, sit on top of a dispenser, and have a condenser and uh, collector hooked up to it that automatically makes arrows. And then just have the arrows piped into the dispenser. We really could, yes, have like a vacuum chest. Yep, and then just have all the shit from all the mobs we kill using it go directly into the frickin', you know, condenser. Increasing yeah. the arrow output. Okay, well, that pretty much took care of our issue with the uh, zombies. So let's head right over here so I can show you what terrible, ungodly, horrifying monstrosity I put together. Yeah, I absolutely love how this looks. I was looking at this at this the other day with my cousins, uh, and I love this. You might want to back up, Charlie. You might want to back up. Why? Uh, or get on this side, Which, whichever. Oh yeah, that's right. I put I, I made that tractor thing for you. That's what I did. Yes, this tractor thing is what lets me gather shit tons of blood. I kind of. However, it has. It has some side effects. Uh, we're not exactly safe right here. Nope. I thought this was full above it. Like I thought this room. Oh yeah, that's right. We was preparing to make a um a cursed earth farm. Yeah. What you might want to do, actually, is have this. Wait, wait. If a mob falls here. Okay, good. They are at head level, so yeah, you'll have like one open block above the altar, I'm guessing. Yeah. And like they'll fall directly on top of the altar. Yeah. Did we ever get a division sigil? Nope, we never got a division sigil to my knowledge. Uh, maybe you did. I'm I'm not sure. The sun came up, which is always nice. Ah, uh, look at all that ambrosia, Charlie. I know. <laughs> no, um, no, no. What I wish you know what you should do. Put one what? of these like near the house, and to where you could just put. Doesn't you like your blood orb hold blood as well? Uh, yes. You should like put one of these for whenever we just go kill like the army, like the wall of zombies. You could just fill up your blood orb. Hmm. Good work. Uh, I know there's a whole entire thing called the Blood Network, so... Yeah. Because I told you about it. <laughs> oh, I, I don't remember you actually told me directly about it. I know I figured it out whenever I was doing Blood Magic to get the, um... The item you could use to move any block without, like, corrupting it. And I was using it to move Hungry Nodes. In, um, a different mod pack. Hmm. Yes. Oh, I got the anvil. Oh, you did? Yes. Well, good. Alright, well, anvil's in my inventory, I guess. Slightly damaged anvil. Well, today, I'm hoping I can get a hold of a bound blade so I can get some weak blood shards. A bound blade. Oh, yeah, because you have, you have to have a bound blade to get weak blood shards. Yes. I think you have, don't you actually have to have the blade just to get blood shards at all? Uh, yeah. That's absolutely terrible. Yeah, it's not as bad as you would think. Yeah, I guess it could be worse. Yeah, I could be bald and look like you. Eh, that wouldn't be too bad. 
I found a Dinopedia in here. Wait, where'd you find it? In the in the farm, in the single chest. Also, a bottle of mana. I think the bottle oh, of mana is th mine. That's right. That's right. I gave the Dinopedia to Cassie for a reason, in case she ever wanted to make another cow. Eh. Uh, okay. Yeah. I don't think she'll ever read it. By the way. Well, you you don't read it. Alright, so, I've got ME working. I guess, what would the next big step be, really? Uh, quarry. Quarry? Yeah. Just turning this whole useless place into a hellish post-industrialized landscape. It's magical. A heat ray barrel. A bedrock pickaxe. That could be interesting. That's for the um, build craft quarry. Mm. Actually, that's for um, BC builders, whatever that is. Yep. Build craft builders. Yeah, that requires a bedrock pickaxe and a heat ray barrel. Hmm. It's from it's from rotary craft though. Bedrock alloy. How do you get bedrock dust? How do you get bedrock alloy at all? I have no idea. Oh, I see. You use a HSLA steel and bedrock dust in a blast furnace to get bedrock alloy. To get the dust, you grind bedrock alloy. I have no idea how to get the bedrock alloy. So I think the build craft quarry is absolutely out. Either way, I want to use the ender quarry. So we need a diamond pickaxe, a diamond enhanced crucial matrix. Okay, so we need lots of quartz first off. Yep, you yep. just need some kind of quartz. Um, so that's ender infused obsidian, which ain't nothing. Uh, thermic pump, which is ender infused. <laughs> this thing's gonna be expensive. Yep. Alright then, so you think we should do a quarry next? Well, if that's what you want. Uh, I'm not I... really sure. I kind of want we... to. Do I mean, solar panels, but I mean, I'm talking about like just to put it on the roof of the windmill to help increase a little bit of output. But I mean, then do solar panels. Then, like as it is now, we are still we're actually evenly maxed out on our power right now. Mm. If I use any machine, we're gonna start draining power. Me. Well. Like, this is even, even. Solar panels it is, then, because that will give us a little bit of a boost. I need to climb up the windmill and figure out how many. Um, uh, I don't know. Okay, where's the fucking phoenix? I need to know how many I need to make. see more room up here than I thought. Okay, so that's one, two, three, four, five, six. Sorry. It's five times one, two, three, four, five. So I need 25. Oh, Charlie, you might want to try getting hold of your luggage and all that. Uh, because I'm going to be going and getting the materials to make ritual inscribing tools. Uh, I think Cassie actually has the luggage. Well, that's a shame, because when I do the ritual of binding, it will summon lightning. 
That's fine. Uh, she should be back later. So, by the way, people, I watched.